So James, thanks for uh, sitting down with me and just sharing a little bit of your story and what goes on around here. But so start with, with yourself. What, uh, tell me about this church and, and what you do here. Well, um, this is Rehoboth Cathedral of Christ. Our senior pastor is Bishop Carter, First Lady Mother Carter. Th those are the, the, the leaders of this church. Um, I am one of the elders here. I'm an associate pastor. And what I do is praise and worship. I preach. I assist the ministry as much as I can uh, for the edifying of Christ and for the betterment of our community. And so this church is kind of right in the heart of the West Side. Like, what, is, what does ministry look like to your community around you? Well, our ministry is consistency. We, we continue to preach the gospel of Jesus Christ, reaching um, the laws. As far as the community, uh, it's been a challenge, um, somewhat difficult, but this area needs a church. Yeah. We, we need a church right here on Main Street. So you all have kind of faced some challenges. Tell us a little bit about kind of the things that have happened to your building. It's, yes. That's tough. It's been cumbersome. Um, from a uh, damaged roof, um, part of it is wear and tear, and majority of it is vandalism. The, the building has suffered so much vandalism as far as uh, puncturing holes through uh, a roof, um, busting windows out, just just really um, running havoc on the building. And and there was even a, somebody living here, kind of squatting in the church? Absolutely. According to what the um, police had told us, the gentleman went to the steeple area and there was uh, clothes and, and uh, I believe a blanket and he was staying there. Not sure how he got in. Uh, I know there were some busted windows and plywood that we had uh, uh, boarded up some windows, and uh, those were crowbarred off um, because so much, so many of the things were desecrated. Um, the, the the individual came in and was eating the communion bread and drinking the communion wine and turned over the podiums and he was just in everything and and, and if anyone ever experienced uh, a break in, you never feel safe. You feel vandalized. Things are not where you left it. Things are missing. And you go back and forth and it just troubles you. But the peace of God had flooded our hearts and our minds and gave us peace. And thanks be to God, the Lord has um, blessed us thus far. We haven't had any, any issue yeah. since. Yeah. So one of the things that we do at River Ridge Church um, is we have uh, something that we call the Dollar Club, right? And so uh, once a month we ask all the folks to just give an extra dollar, an extra couple dollars, uh, and then we look for a place uh, in the community where we can be a blessing as a congregation to, to somebody else. Um, and so today I brought with me a check um, for you and the church for $4,561. And this is for you to fix this place up after the vandals have left. Uh, wow. Wow, I'm speechless. <laughs> um, God bless you. And um, you, this ministry that has sold into us, I, I am just uh, speechless. I didn't see this. <laughs> <laughs> Well, good. We just are thrilled to come alongside you. Love what yes. you're doing here. Yes. Um, and you know, when when you know when one part of the body suffers, the rest suffers. And yes. so I kind of feel like we suffer along with you, but at the same time, we can be a blessing and, and to help out in this small way to get you guys head in the right direction. Yes, so. oh, th this certainly will um, help us get to where we need to be to do uh, the ministry in excellence as God has uh, uh, commissioned us to do. God bless you. And I thank you, Rehoboth Cathedral of Christ and Bishop Carter, uh, First Lady uh, Carter. We all love you and thank you, not just because of this, but because you have, sh you share the burden with us. Yeah.